The House Committee on Legislative Franchises issues a show cause order against the National Telecommunications Commission, or NTC, Monday, May 11. The panel wants NTC to explain why it should not be held in contempt for ordering the closure of media network ABS-CBN. The House dragged its feet in deliberating bills that would have renewed ABS-CBN's franchise. Instead, Cayetano wrote a letter enjoining the NTC to grant ABS-CBN a temporary permit to continue operating, pending the renewal of its franchise. But a day after the franchise's expiration on May 5, the NTC issued a cease-and-desist order against the media giant, forcing it to go off-air. This happened after Solicitor General Jose Calida warned NTC officials they could be held liable for graft if they allow ABS-CBN to keep operating. In a parallel move, the Senate on Monday passes a resolution, urging the NTC to reconsider the cease-and-desist order. The resolution also reiterates the Senate's stand that ABS-CBN should be allowed to continue operations while its franchise is pending. Eight senators abstain from voting, arguing the ball is now at the lower chamber and the Supreme Court. ABS-CBN had asked the High Court for a temporary restraining order against NTC's cease and desist order. Meantime, billionaire and President Duterte's campaign donor Dennis Uy rejects talks he is out to buy ABS-CBN. In a statement Sunday, May 10, Uy says Udena Corporation does not plan on venturing into broadcasting. Mm-hmm.